Um, here's another picture of celebrities doing the attending the spirit cooking. This is obviously a doll, and it looks like that's cake. Um, but see how she like is has like cuts in her legs. Um, Marina is huge. Her art is huge in self harm, like just huge. Um, she promotes that greatly. Let's see here. Sorry, bear with me. I lost my place. Um, here we are. So here's another one. And it just tells you like no one in their right mind would make a cake that looks like a human and then have knives sticking out of it. Nobody in their right mind. Here we have another picture. And you know, this is such an interesting picture because that looks like a young Newsom. I know it's not him, but it does look like him a lot. Um, and here we have Lady Gaga, Mr. Biden himself, um, you know, spirit cooking and, you know, it's great stuff. And here we have some more Lady Gaga enjoying the human soup. Uh, and she's wearing this cross. You can see more about this Ishtar and Rothschild. Pause it, look more into it. She likes to do pictures like this, which do not seem demonic or satanic at all. So just to give you a clear picture of who she is, I think that's pretty clear enough. Oh, let's look at this one. This artist is seeming to enjoy um, what she's doing. Okay. Um, so there's another one that I wanted to show you guys that's pretty disturbing as well here we go so they're cutting up the cake that looks like a human i don't know what kind of party these are you guys truly um and this one right here lady gaga when she went to the awards with like raw meat on her on her shoes and i think that's just such a big statement right because in witchcraft there's sacrificing or even in the pagan religions there was a lot of sacrificing of animals to their gods and humans to their gods and to have like raw meat it's just depraved and if there was a kid who went to school dressed like this with raw meat like they would pull him so fast and say that he has a mental disorder and say that he's not right in the head and that he's showing signs of being a sociopath and yet you know serial killer kind of behavior and yet when artists do it it's okay why why is it okay because we're sending kids mixed signals here and i suppose that that's the point but i also find this interesting in the liberal sense you know how they like to say like don't eat meat everybody go vegan yada 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 and she's such a liberal like that um she's so like pro-vegan and all this stuff but you actually slaughtered an animal just to wear it just to wear it and I do want to say that you know if you're going to slaughter an animal you should eat it and respect it and honor it by consuming it and nourishing your body with it and not just trashing it and this is trashing it because animals are creations of God as well right and god does care about the animals so we should treat them with respect and she's not by slaughtering it just to wear it just to make an appearance and then throw it in the garbage because clearly nobody's gonna eat it now there's so much more that i do want to show you about you know lady gaga and whatnot but we'll get into those spider webs later because there's so much going on here um and this picture right here kind of really bothers me because what does a child without a shirt have to do with this woman who fantasizes about all these pictures that we just saw? And yet the owner of Balenciaga, Francis Pinoy, whatever his name is, I really don't care to pronounce it correctly. Um, I don't respect him enough to care that much. Um, yeah, like he is friends with this woman who has a picture of a child who 
has no shirt on and yet he owns an auction house where he sells child mannequins as young as 18 months old what they look like for adult sexual use so yeah it's very very interesting now so that's her and that's who he's friends with um i do want to show you a quick clip of him um i know a lot of people were saying that he is not aware he you know runs a big company he can't be aware of everything that is done in the company um he can't possibly know every little detail so i do want to show you this amazing clip number 13 he decides what happens with each brand under caring so already this francis henry pinoy guy isn't looking like he's an innocent character to me and there's just so much so much down this rabbit hole and we will expose everyone every single one as long as i have a voice and they, i can find a platform to put it up on i will expose every single person so again from the top francis pinoy married to salma hayek now do you think that salma hayek is not aware of what her husband is doing do you really really think that she's not aware in the history of all the cartels in the history of all the bad guys has have their wives been innocent have they not known you're guilty by association woman like that you know what he's doing why is he selling child mannequins for adult use who is he selling them to and is that all he's selling okay um so we see what kind of man they he is and what kind of people they are and who they associate with and that says a lot now in the next episode i don't want to make these super long i'm gonna go ahead and break down group artemis what that is when he acquired it and what they also have acquired because when I tell you that this whole ring is satanic and demonic, I'm not even joking. Now, if you're an atheist and you don't believe in God and you don't believe in the devil, I want to know why. And you can leave it in the comments and give me food for thought. Um, why is Marina and all these celebrities so obsessed with demonic things and pagan rituals? And they talk about rituals all the time and fasting and then doing a ritual and there's just so many things so if the devil and god are not real why are these people obsessed with them and why are they causing real harm in the name of art so i'm gonna leave it there for today because i know that it's a lot and going in, going into group artemis is going to be a lot so i'm going to pause you guys here and i'll see you guys in the next episode